What is going on, Pokemon community? It is Poke Collector NYC. We have another box, and we are going to enjoy this booster box. This is, I think, the fourth booster box of our case. Let's see if we can get any crazy pulls here in today's video. Thank you all for watching. Please consider subscribing to the channel, hitting the notification bell, and smashing that like button. We want to see what we get here today. I don't, I don't know why that didn't open anything, but we'll see here. If you haven't seen our openings, you know, we, we know, I think everybody knows, in Silver Tempest, or just in general, booster boxes come with two Radiant uh, collection cards, four trainer galleries, and about six to eight hits. Um, we, we have had a, okay, we've had like one or, out of the four boxes, or sorry, three boxes we've opened, we had two good boxes, one kind of like rough box. So, um, we'll see what we can do here, if we do anything better, uh, in today's video, but let's get into it. 36 packs of goodness, rapid ass reverse rare, pretty sure that was the first time we saw that, and Armaldo, with a V-check lane. Um, shout out to Blue EX for being a Patreon member. Patreon members get cards from our openings. So Blue EX, you're probably gonna get something from uh, our openings here. So we'll see uh, what you get. Hopefully you get some good cards. First black and white code card is just a hollow Rapidash. I'm gonna put it to the side because I like that card. That's pretty cool. We got a, a reverse version and a, um, yeah, a reverse hollow and a regular hollow version. Oh, back to back black and white code cards. So does that mean we're gonna get something crazy out of here? The artwork in Silver Tempest is pretty cool. I will give it that. Rainbow. Rainbow trainer. Rainbow, footy sold, footy sold girl. Very cool, first rainbow, well, second rainbow we've seen from this set. Um, there are a number. Obviously, we want Lugia VMAX, but, or V-Star, but we will take a rainbow for our trainer. So that is the first hit of the box. Not too shabby. Let's see what else we can do here. Ooh, there's like three black-to-back -back black and white code cards. So we get a Kruk, Kruk, and a Superior V. We have not seen too many Superiors so far out of the set, but we will take that. Superior V right there. So two Vs back to back, zero Radiance, zero Trainer Galleries. But that is not a bad thing at all. Okay, we kind of switched styles there. I don't know why we switched styles, but let's see here. Wow, fourth black and white go-kart out of six cart uh, six packs. So this is Zubat Fungus, Trainer Gallery, I see you. Which one are you gonna be? Ooh, Milotic, we don't have Milotic. So that's a good one to get. And what is this one? A Lugia V-Star, there we go. Very nice, very nice. Lugia V-Star right here. One of the more popular cards, probably one of my, we already have a Lugia V, we have the full art Lugia, and now we have a Lugia V-Star. I will take that all day. That was a great double pack hit right there, Milotic. And a Lugia V-Star right there. Starting, this box is starting off very strong. I'm actually quite happy with what we have here so far on the left side. Um, so we got a Galele and a Miss Magnus. Um, but yeah, we already have three hits, three regular hits and one trainer gallery. One of them being a V-Star Lugia and the other one being a Fuso Girl. Um, again, another black and white code card. There is also, I think I see it right. Hey, Durandolin VMAX and an Archaeotop Hollow. Very nice, our second gold from this set in the Trainer Gallery uh, slot. I don't remember how many there are actually. So second Trainer Gallery, let me actually go look at the book. Do I have the book? I don't even know how many gold cards are there in the Trainer Gallery section. So looking back at the Trainer Gallery section here in the Elite Trainer Box booklet, you have, actually, there, we have both of them. We have Rayquaza and Durandolin. That's pretty cool. So, I mean, we're still missing quite a few of these. I mean, I would love that Corviknight or Rayquaza VMAX. Um, that would be actually fantastic. But we'll see if we get to pull them. Um, you know, the trainer gallery is, I wouldn't say hard to complete, but it's definitely harder to get certain cards, if that makes sense. 
uh, pet tail and then the mint. That's pretty cool. But yeah, I actually got the evolution right there. Um, all right. Another black and white code card. Okay, this is pretty good. This is, we are doing actually extremely well. Oh, is this Ho Ho? Please be Ho Ho. Oh no, it's a superior full art V. Not too shabby. We got a superior full art V, a Lugia, and a fursoed girl in the left side. That is, you know, that's that's pretty good. We have not gotten a radiant, and I we you know, I think we're we're only due a radiant on this left side now. I think at this point, but we'll see. Wow, that was a uh, pretty good. I don't know what you guys think. You let me know. Um, how do you think about this? What do you think about this box so far? Um, but yeah, uh, this is actually really great. Volpix and Verizon Wireless. I don't know what else this this uh, left side could possibly give us. Again, Secret Rare does not take place of a alternate art. So we could see a Gardevoir. Wow, I didn't even know we were still owed in a trainer gallery. And a regular V Hisuian Arcanine. So, pretty. We had a, a few double, double banger hits coming out of Butcher Packs. Uh, so that's pretty good. So Hisuian Arcanine, just a regular V. Well, we got three, three. Count them up. Three fantastic Trainer Gallery cards. So we're up to five regular hits and three Trainer Galleries. I really don't think that, that you could possibly get any, any better than that. On the left side, we're gonna actually move the bulk. We're moving the bulk now into the left side. Here, real quick. And we only had a couple more packs anyway. So why don't we open up the couple more packs here from that left side and see what else we could do. Um, could we pull an alternate art? We have yet to pull an alternate art. We did not pull a single alternate art in the previous set. Crooked Duke and Ninetales. So, um, which is kind of wild to think about because we did do an entire case of that last set and we pulled zero alt arts. So they have definitely decreased the alt art ratio. Finnegan and Hisuian Bravery. All right, let's see what we got here. Two more packs. We got two more packs. And that's one of these has to have Radiant. It's not gonna be this car pack, but it's definitely gonna be this pack. Call, in, call it out, guys. We're gonna call out a Radiant in this pack. Are we going to be right? We were wrong, so both Radiants are actually on the right side. Very, very interesting. I've never actually had that happen before, so far. At least not in this set. I could be wrong in other sets, but. All right, let's keep it rolling. We did get five, eight hits out of the left side. So we did get eight hits out of the left side. So, I mean, that was a pretty strong first start there. Cobalion, regular rare. Uh, there is a trainer card in here, like a hollow, which I find very interesting because it's like a different, it looks very cool. Black and white. Could this be a regular V? No, it's another full art. Please be ho-ho. Please be ho-ho. It's chestnut V. I really want a ho-ho. But I'll take that chestnut V. So far, the full arts, I think we should be good in the full arts unless they give us something, I think something special. But we uh, we got our two full arts at least. Finally, a regular box in full arts. Uh, we had a box with like only one full art, which is like really rough and not even a secret rare. Rhinoculus and Bravery. Can we finally get a secret rare? Please, I am praying for one. Oh, that was just a Nordicuno. I was like, ooh, there's something in the back there. Um, surprisingly, we only got two regular Vs, so I'm sure we're gonna get two more regular Vs, um, at least one training gallery and one reading collection. So um, that is the ratios I'm gonna call out, uh, but we shall see. Um, not bad box so far. I mean, it isn't crazy. I mean, we just hit one gold and we hit a Lugia, but again, Radiant Alakazam, there you go. Again, these are beautiful. I like these. So one radiant, uh, but yeah, it's, it's nothing crazy. Uh, we shall see black and white code card, hollow or better, probably a regular V. 
because we are due for one, but we also get the Jinx. And a regular V Skunk Tank, because we've not seen Skunk Tank. All, actually this is the first Skunk Tank V we've actually pulled, which is actually kind of crazy to think about. But let's go ahead and sleeve up that Skunk Tank, and let's go ahead and sleeve up that Jinx. So very beautiful Trainer Gallery cards so far. We have four Trainer Gallery cards. Um, we're due for at least one more race. I don't know if we're gonna have another Trainer Gallery card, but we shall see. Can we also hit an alternate art? Because full arts and secret rares do not take place of the alternate art. Alternate arts come in randomly. So let's find out. Call Balian and Miss Magus. We still have a handful of pack stuff. Again, I'm only expecting literally one radiant and one V left in this future box, but we shall see. It is going to be Noivern and Crossglass. Let's see. Ooh, black and white code card, regular V, or just a regular hollow. Look at that. I was all crooked up in that one. Ha, get it. Get it, Pokemon community. I cannot even. All right, white code card which means it's just a Donphan and a Mungus. What else can we get? White Code Card. Miss Mangus and Del Fox. Can we... We got another Training Gallery, Rock Ruff. All right, that was definitely something I wasn't expecting. Rock Ruff, love that cute little doggo. That's actually a cute card, I'll take that. So we actually have five trainer galleries. We're definitely missing one more unit and probably one more V out of these four packs. Let me know what you think we're gonna get. Uh, more Peko and Peony. All right, let's see what else we got here. Let's see what we got. White code card. Radiant? Nope. But a Verizon Wireless. So we only got two more packs left. Let's move them over. Let's put the bulk in here and call it a day. Um, overall, not a bad box. I would say not a bad box, but again, it's because we have at least one media. Uh, but, you know, you let me know what your thoughts are in the comment section below. Probably the final black and white code card. And it's just going to be a hollow. All right, call it out a Radiant Collection card in this one. So we only pull the Alakazam, and we're supposed to get an average of two. But is this gonna be a black and white border? Yes, it is. So, let's do the code card. Code, let's, let's do the, the trick, yeah? Fighting, Torcat, Dragonair, Venomoth, Fanfi, Indeedee, Marini, Mischievous, well, blue, actually no rating. Interesting enough, we only got one at the Sam. Box ratios all over the place. And our regular V is going to be a chestnut. Wow, this is a chestnut box. So not too shabby, not too shabby. We did get our four Vs, pretty standard stock Vs. We got only our Radiant Alakazam, oddly enough. And we did get five rating collection, I'm sorry, trainer gallery cards. Some beauties, some new ones, and this Duran Lynn VMAX. And then, of course, we get our two full arts, our Lugia and Photostilled Girl. Let me know what your thoughts are. Hey guys, thanks so much for watching. Please consider subscribing to the channel, hitting that notification bell, and smashing that like button. This is Poke Collector NYC, and we'll see you next time.